Damn. Man, we got it all going on. In fact, we're just going to get it straight to it because there's going to be no messing about of any kind. Boom. Well, there you go. I was going to do another thingy, but you know what? Forget that now, even. <laughs> Man, it's too early for this shit. Hello, everyone. Welcome. It's, uh, it's like... 6.30 a.m. Where I am. And uh, I'm starting early. So I can finish early. And we got um, a long haul flight. From Honolulu all the way to Australia. And um, they're waiting for me to close the doors. Let's hop into this bad boy here. It's cold and dark. You can't see a thing. There's no power anywhere, man. So before we start turning things off... we or whatever we need to get we need to put some power into this puppy there we go now we can uh do what they want us to do what's this the uh doors close exit three i don't know which one exit three is close and i'll open exit three i don't think it knows what it wants right atc so we can track it on project fly Papa Hotel, India, Kilo there Airport Information, Charlie, 1053, Zulu, weather, wind, 301, at 3, visibility, 10, sky condition, few clouds at 2,500, Papa Hotel, India, Kilo Airport Information, Charlie, 1053, yep. Zulu, okay. weather, we wind, 2. That. Right, I think we need lights in this cabin here. I feel like a wet bandit scrambling in the dark. Um... Lights. Refueling completed. Whoa, that was quick. Now this, this bird takes a lot of fuel. Open exit three. Oh, dude, which one's exit three? Keeps crying, man. Open exit three, close exit three. <laughs> right. Uh, open exit two, open exit three. Mate, all the doors are open. What the fuck is wrong with this thing? Maybe it's too early for the plane as well. Right, let's get some lights on here to show that we're in. Passengers are going to start boarding soon. Passengers are boarding already, to be honest. Okay. Right. Let's get clearance. Cockpit preparation. Go through a checklist. Off. Checklist completed. Clearance delivery, I'm U8519 with the information request clearance. Flight number maintained 6000. Expect flight level 350 within 10 minutes after departure. Departure frequency 118 decimal 3. Squawk 2320. QNH 1017. Clearance to destination airport via LP8 Hotel. India to departure. Expect vectors to LP8 H8 climb and maintain 6000. Flight level 350 within 10 minutes after departure. Departure on 118 decimal 3. Squawk 2320. QNH 1017. MU 8519 and 8. Maui 519 and 8. Read back correct. Contact ground control on 121 decimal 9. Roger 121 decimal 9. MU 8519 and 8. Man, I barely understood anything he just said then. Man, that, that that readout was... I can barely hear what he said then. Barely make it out. Right, let me just put this here. We'll sort this out in a second. I still feel that the lights in this place are too low. Um, I forget where all the lights are. In fact, hang on. Let me start the um, ILS here. Because that's going to take a while to get going. Boarding complete. Man, that was quick. Close the doors. I doors locked. Cross check. Oh, that was very quick. Shut all the doors. Right. Let's uh, battery on. 
Uh, IPU generator. Buses. Fuel pumps. Um, they're going to give me the load sheet now, so I'll be able to sort that out. Alright. Them two doors should be closing. Uh, overhead light. No, that's not it. Yeah, there we go. That'll do. Right. That's better. <sighs> okay, let's have a look at our checklist here. What we got? Battery on. Standby power on. Wipers. Landing gear down. Radar off. Parking brake set. Thrust levers closed. Flaps up. And that's the safety checklist done. Check the flaps. Yep. Everything's as is. Um, IRS is aligned. Emergency exits armed. Um, Yaw dampers clicked. Bus ties autoed. Bus ties. Uh, there's a bus tie. Maui, oh, yeah. 5198. Squawk 2320. Squawk 2320, two, at me, that's 5198. 2320. 2320. 2320. Two, two, there we go, just squawk that now. Um, landing altitude. I'll just set it for 200 now and then we'll see later. Fuel pump set, hydraulic set, check, check. Um, uh, packs, all the elite thingies, turn them off. Um, do that. Pardon me. That's the packs done. Give an announcement to Hello, the people. Hello, gentlemen. From the flight deck, it's the captain. Very warm welcome on board this Boeing 7. We're just about ready to push back from stand now and start all engines. I would uh, ask that you pay full attention, please, to the cabin crew's safety briefing that will be shown fairly shortly. In the meantime, make yourselves as comfortable as possible and enjoy the takeoff. Thank you. Right, let's set this up now. P H N L. Oop. And I'll the gate. I don't know what gate we're at. So that's that. PH and L. Um. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome on board this Boeing seven seven. May I remind you that your hand luggage should be placed in the overhead compartments. And in the interest of safety, heavy bags or bottles must be placed underneath the seat in front of you. And all arms and exits must be kept clear. Thank you. Destination we're going to today is Sydney, Australia. So, that should be good. And we do have a company route. P-H-N-L-Y-S-S-Y. We need an, a zero one at the end. Oh no, hang on. There it is. Oh, actually, no. Um, it's not that one. It's the one that. Um, yeah, Maui five one nine eight. Squawk two three two zero. Squawk two three two zero. Maui eight five one nine eight. We need the one that. Uh, Pro ATC know about for everybody to be singing the same tune, which is this one. 
That's the one that they've created. Activate that. We'll bring it up on our thing here as well, Navigraph. So we can see a nice visual of it. It comes up with errors all over the place. Right, so we're departing runway 26 left um, on the uh, Opti H2, is it? Uh, this one with no, no transition. So that's interesting. I mean, I've got to choose one here. Yeah, that's th that's the departure right there. But according to Pro ATC, there's no transition attached to it. So, I mean, I just I just whoa, what the hell? That's what it looks like. Twenty six left. Um, that one. Go for the choco. Um, yeah, that's pretty much what it looks like. That's that's good enough. Okay, so we'll sort the arrival out later. Um, I best do with the other company route. To be fair, um, otherwise this one's going to be having us go all over the world. Right, there we go. Flight number um, TWA. We are today. Flight number two. Th Sorry. Call signs MUI. MUI 5198. 5198. Um, that's that. Right, let's sort this performance data out now. So, uh, fuel wise, our zero fuel, uh, or our fuel is 134.0. Zero. Can't change that. Maybe I have to do it on air first. Three four point zero fuel. There we go. And our payload. Oh, hang on, wait, that's not our fuel, dude. Our fuel is that, which is one three three point nine. Oh, that'll do. Um, payload today is sixty five point two. Um, that's everything there set up. Right, so some of these, you know, current CG. What? We're going up to thirty five thousand feet today. Three five three five zero Sla oh actually Cost index eighteen Maximum altitude is thirty three thousand Right We'll have to go to thirty three thousand then Cost index of 18. Um, CG 25.1. Um, the reserves we've got in the tank are 6 tons. It's 
zero fuel weight is thought it said it here. Maybe not. Zero fuel weight is two six zero point eight. Two six zero point eight. Um, that's that done. Flaps 10, I think, today. Oh, can't have flaps 10. Flaps 5, then. Um, take off gross weight is 393.7. Seven. Um, cost twenty five. Trim today is four point two five. So, oops, four two five. Thrust. Uh, I don't know. Wind today is blowing at three ten at three knots. Three ten at three knots. Um, and the outside temperature is 23.9 we'll say 24 it's closer alright I think that's it let's do the departure we are departing from 26 left using the OP whatever thingy and what transition did I say I mean I think that, that, let me just try these other ones real quick, oh, Choco, okay, using the Choco today, um, hang on, so if that didn't go in, uh, 26, RP, Choco, why doesn't that activate? Transition. Yep, yeah, that's fine. Oh, there we go. Now it's in. Right. Uh, discontinuity there. Sort that on the next page. I've got to sort that out. That's why. Barker. Okay, I think that's everything for that. We can get going. Let me get rid of this. Let's get permission to get out of here. Ground by MU, day 5198, request start up and push back. Maui, 5198, start up and push back approved. Roger, by MU, day 5198. Right, so, um, I haven't even started the APU. Dude, that's a fail, isn't it? We gotta wait for the APU to come online. Um, we're the IRS is set. That's all good. Um, as soon as the APU comes on, we can disconnect the uh, ground power. Let's get push back rolling. And we need to disconnect the GPU. Get rid of that. APU is running. Disconnect from the ground power. So that's that done. Okay. So. 
fuel set. Altimeters are set. Hello, Captain. We're ready for pushback. Cool. Me too. Let's rock and roll it. Um. Right guys, we're ready to rock and roll here. Um all the doors are locked, checked. Check Anti collision Bypass light going on. Release parking brakes. Parking brakes released. Commencing push. AP all is on. Packs are off. Um Doors are armed and closed. Seatbelt signs on. Uh, right then, let's start the engine up. Everything's up here set, so um, let's start the engine ignite. It's it's working. for a good setup. Right. Fuel. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome aboard. We ask that you please fasten your seat belt at this time and secure all baggage underneath your seat or in the overhead compartments. We also That's ask lit. that your seats and table trays are in the upright position for takeoff. This is not all personal electronic devices, including laptops and cell phones. Smoking is prohibited for the duration of the flight. Thank you for charging us. Enjoy your flight. Right, that's that. Next one. Let's go in. Up. Waiting your confirmation for good engine start. We're clear up to six thousand feet. snapped in. That's the engine started. Have we got good engine start on both? Yes, we have. Cool. Right. Generators are all on. Check. Uh, hydraulics packs. Turn them on now. Packs are on. Um... Get permission. Unlocking gear. Permission to get to the taxiway. Grand Lamb, you at 5198, request taxi. Maui, 5198, taxiway Absolutely. Alpha, Yankee, Bravo, Delta, Delta Romeo, Alpha, to runway 26 left. Via Alpha, Yankee, Bravo, Delta, Romeo, Alpha, to runway 26 left. Lamb, you at 5198. Gotta break RTO flight controls. Let's do a flight test. Make sure the controls are free and clear. Which they are. Tow truck disconnected. Check. Um, our brake turn off lights need to be set. Um, weather radar. Uh, weather radar. That 
that's terrain, that's weather. Um, Left is clear. Right is clear. Anti ice is uh, engine that anti ice is on. Auto throttle is armed. Check, crew are seated, elevator trim is set, strobe lights are set. Landing lights need to go on when we leave the runway. Um, and transponder is transponding. Let's do a TCAS check and we're out of here. TCAS test pass. Boom. It's a pass. Turn the PA on. Give a final Ladies call. Ladies and gentlemen, your safety aboard this aircraft is our primary consideration. Please refrain from reading magazines and newspapers. We will now show a short video demonstrating safety procedures for this aircraft. You will find a safety card in the seat pocket in front of you. Please study this carefully. Thank you for your attention and wish you a pleasant flight. Right, it's... Do you know what? It's only... What time is it in the... In the uh, in the sim right now, it's only quarter to eight at night in the sim. So, let's, uh, there we go. Right then, let's go. We're pretty full today. We're quite heavy. Should be a nice takeoff today. And then um, about 10 hours time, the landing. Ladies and gentlemen, we will turn off the cabin lights for the takeoff. Will we? Oh, start the clock. What a pretty lights. Lower that over it down a bit. Well, that's where these lights are here. This is what I'm looking for. Runway lights or oh, turn runway turn well uh, runway turn 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 off runway lights are on. Man it's too early in the morning man. About three hours sleep, if that. Maybe two. I'm, I mean I'm wide awake, but I'm not. <laughs> Let's say if I didn't start this flight at like, you know, now, uh, we wouldn't be in the air till like 9 or 10, which means we wouldn't be landing till like, you know, 11 o'clock at night, and that's just not good. <laughs> so.
Okay. Can't think of anything else that I need to be doing here. I feel like I'm missing something out there. Definitely. Yeah. You know? I think I've set this all up completely. Can't think of anything I might have missed out. We do need to set up the arrival. Um, this should be a good takeoff because the. Um, like we'll be departing straight off the, the island, but um, I think we actually hover over another island. Oh, Project Fly. I need to start that. Shit. I haven't even... Oh, bollocks, man. <laughs> Why did it open that up on this pay on this window? Dude, he's gonna, he's gonna bugger off his if we get too close. Right, let's put that on the other page. The window. Dispatch. Fly now. Phew. That's that sorted. Almost forgot that one. Idea where the runway is. I'm guessing it's going this way, though. I think that's Honolulu in the background there, in the distance. All the buildings, the city of Honolulu. And the mountains possibly over here. I think it is anyway. Right, we can run up to runway 26. That's the next one. Dude. Am I going that fast or something? Come on, boy. set the flaps. So this is the runway, so taxi lights off. Landing lights on. Maui, five one nine eight. 
Contact power on 118, decimal 1, 1, 1, 8, decimal 1, I am you at 5, 1, 9, and 8. Tower, I'm you at 519 and 8, holding short of runway 26 left, ready for departure. Maui, 519 and 8, line up runway 26 left. Lining up runway 26 left, I'm you at 519 and 8. This is our runway. It's going to the right. Okay. Anything else we need to do here? Um, can't think of anything. Um, the passenger signs to auto. Run, line up on the runway. We'll be taking off soon. Thank you very much, right. Take off, runway two six left. Do I am you at five one nine and eight. Um, before takeoff. Yep, everything's set. It's rock and roll time. Let's go. Rock and roll. Sixteen thousand. Let's 
It's our flight plan. No restrictions. Checklist. Landing gear up, check. And locked. Flaps up, check. Altimeter set, which we will set now um, for standard. And we hit 18,000. Landing lights off. Turnway lights off. Nose gear lights off. Hopefully we should be doing a turn. Engine control switches to flight. Uh, this is your captain speaking. First, I'd like to welcome everyone on our flight. We are currently cruising at an altitude of 11,000 feet, and at the ground speed of approximately 400 miles per hour. In the moment of operates, we should get a great view as we descend the cabin. We will be coming around shortly, offering you light snacks and beverages. Then, sit back, relax, and enjoy the rest of the flight. course. Ooh, uh, anti-ice is on, yep. What's that say? Window heat. What's it doing? Dude, what are you doing? We should be connecting on this line here.
So we're slightly off it. We're going to go direct to here because this isn't correct. So we're going to go direct to here. Six thousand feet. Q and H set. Beautiful sky out there. We need to go to 33,000 feet because um, our plane won't make it to 35. So when he clears us for 35, we have to then ask for 33. <clears throat> Six. We've got thirty three for Barker. Let's get permission to go to thirty three.
30,000 feet. As soon as we get to 33,000 feet, then um, that's pretty much it. Um, so, I mean, that's it for the till the descent, really. So, what we'll do is we'll sort out the um, approach and arrival and get that mailed in there. And, I mean, that's it. Until until we uh, come back, which uh, is just under 10 hours time, which will put it, say, 7.30, 8.30, 9.30, 10, 30, 5.30 tonight. Um, so we'll probably resume at about 5 o'clock tonight, maybe 4.30. So what I'll do now, actually, is I'll set that up. So it's scheduled in as the next stream. Because today is Thursday. So I'll put 4.30 for now. In fact, no, I'll put 5 for now. But it might change. That's in the middle, that is. So, save that. Should show that. There we go. Thursday, 5 p.m. tonight. Ooh. never set the climb power. So we're at cruise now, so we'll set the cruise power. Um, Seatbelt signs can come off. Um, all the lights are the way they should be. Yep. Turn them lights off. Uh, right, let's sort out the arrival, shall we? So, this is where we are now. We're at the uh, the Barker Barker end. Right, so we'll be coming down here, basically completely across the Pacific Ocean. I mean, this is probably the most dangerous flight because if anything happens, you're just going to get ditching in the sea and never found. So, okay, uh, flight plan. Our flight plan has as expected on runway seven, the ILS. Runway 7, there it is. Um, there is no approach or star. It's just, that's what it is. It's a basically almost a straight in, the looks of it. 
which that's pretty good. Um, so yeah, we can set that up pretty easy. Um, approach speeds. Uh, I forgot how to do this now. Departure approach, and usually, oh here it is, arrivals, duh, ILS 7, um, no transition, no approach, just a straight in, so if we go to the legs now, that should reflect, gotta get rid of that vector there. This affects the plan. So you go out, turn back in. seems a bit weird. Come out, literally immediately come back in. Is that the wrong way? Six miles, 15 miles. Is that vectors? That's the issue. fine to me, but seven. Yeah, so we have to come down, immediately turn to go back up. It's it's a very weird landing. Anyway. It is what it is. Um the altitude for all this. to this you come over the airport turn around and come back in to land so I think it needs a yeah, it looks like it needs an arrival
that's it. It's uh, nothing but open ocean now, and uh, yeah. So, five o'clock tonight, guys, we'll be coming back and resuming the flights. And so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna kill the stream here. I'm not even gonna do any fancy goodbye or anything like that. We're just gonna literally, and then bring it in when uh, when we're closer. And in the sim time, it will be. Um, about four or five in the morning in the sim time, so yeah. Um, yeah. Still dark time. <laughs> still, it'll still be night time. Or it should be night, still be night time. I mean, I, I might have to reset the time for um, Australia. Because right now in Australia, what time is it? In Sydney. This will give us an indication, actually. It's four o'clock in, in the afternoon in Sydney. So in ten hours' time, um, that would make it 2 a.m. So... Yeah. It's going to be a nighttime landing, guys. Anyway... Thank you.